Welcome to this university's awards ceremony. I have a number of announcements to make before the formal proceedings begin. Firstly, please switch your mobile phone to silent. Secondly, I'm sure you'd all like to express your appreciation for the band of the Bournemouth Concert Brass who have played so well for us under the direction of Ian McGilligott. <laughs> Finally, at the end of the ceremony, please remain standing until all the processions have left. Please feel free to head to the reception in the Purbeck Hall. This is a day for celebration. Enjoy the ceremony and please do clap and cheer when your friends and family cross the stage. Welcome to your graduation. I've, I've really enjoyed the, you know, the four years that I've been here. I really loved it when I came on the first open day. I'll be really sad to leave. I think it exceeded my expectations. On behalf of the faculty, congratulations to all of you graduating here today. You are all the future. Indeed, you are important for all of our futures in this faculty. And I hope that you all have exciting and rewarding careers. I also hope that you'll take away from BU not just the expertise that you've learned in your courses, but fond memories of a supportive and positive environment. So congratulations to you again and let's hope that you and all your friends and families watching here today and online have a truly wonderful day. Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the procession of the Chairman of East Dorset District Council, the University Board, Senate and the Pro-Chancellor. <laughs>
Please be seated. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, the Pro Chancellor, Mrs. Valerie Pitt Rivers. Good morning, everybody. Distinguished guests, Vice Chancellor, family members, partners, friends, and most important of all, graduates. Welcome to your Bournemouth University graduation ceremony for the Faculty of Science and Technology. And as a pro chancellor of the university, I'm really privileged to be representing the chancellor at this ceremony today. And I'm also delighted to welcome our honorary fellow, Stephen Thorne, and you'll hear more about him later, and the chairman of East Dorset District Council, Councillor Mrs. Tony Coombs. I stand here filled with, well, both trepidation and delight. Trepidation because it is a great honor and a great responsibility to preside over uh, such an important occasion marking your tremendous achievements. And delight, because it really is wonderful to be with you here today and share this very special occasion with you. Besides, I'm reliably informed that I have the easy job because having taken part in previous graduation ceremonies in my role as pro-chancellor, I can say with some certainty that it's your friends and families who have the most work to do today. Ladies and gentlemen, you have a lot of clapping ahead of you because this morning nearly 500 students from, three, from 30 countries will be receiving their degrees. Graduation is a major achievement, so there should be lots of cheering and applause, even a bit of whooping if you feel like it, because you've certainly earned it, and I really mean that. Some of you might have expected this to be a solemn affair, Far from it. You are our honoured guests for the day, so please enjoy yourself, because it is a day which I'm quite sure you will remember for the rest of your life. And I'm well aware that supporting someone through university can be tough, and that many of you here today will be reflecting on time growing up 
the years at school, and then the achievement of gaining admission to university. You've supported them through all of this, and through their years at BU, and the pressures of exams, and the anxiety of waiting for results. And our academic and support staff work very hard to support our students too. So congratulations are actually due to everyone in this room and to those watching all over the world, wherever they are. But of course, our main congratulations must go to you, our graduates. We are very proud of you, and you should be very proud of yourselves, because you have put in a tremendous amount of hard work and effort to earn your qualifications, and that does make it a great achievement. And there are lots of reasons to celebrate your success, because BU graduates are extremely employable. But while employability is important, university also gives you opportunities to grow in many other ways, to explore new interests, develop skills, and, of course, make friends which you will keep for the rest of your life. And where could be better to study and do all this than here in Bournemouth in beautiful Dorset? Every year, our design and engineering students showcase their projects in our summer festival, meeting businesses and, quite often, finding buyers for their projects. Of course, cybersecurity, data and privacy issues have been big stories this year. And, as well as these challenges, we are very aware of the positive contribution that technology, games and music make to our society. The creative industries also make a con significant contribution to Bournemouth's economy, so I hope that some of you will stay in the area and be part of this thriving uh, sector in the future. BU adds more than a million pounds a day to the region's economy, and our students do even more by volunteering with local, national and global projects and raising money for local charities. So as well as celebrating your academic success, we thank you for the role you have played in building BU's reputation in the community and much further afield. I hope you have many fond memories of your time at BU and that you will keep coming back to visitors year after year. And please don't forget to stay connected through our alumni network. So my very best wishes to all of you for whatever you do choose to do next. And I now have great pleasure in declaring this ceremony open. Thank you. This congregation is assembled for the conferment of the award of Honorary Fellow. Pro-Chancellor, I invite Professor Timothy Darville to present Mr. Stephen Thorne. Pro-Chancellor. As former Head of Planning and Regeneration for the Borough of Poole, Stephen Thorne's career has left a lasting legacy on the physical landscape of our region. Stephen was also a key partner in the creation of Bournemouth University's Estate Development Plan, which is transforming our campuses. Stephen began his work as a draftsman of the Ordnance Survey. Over the course of eight years, he completed a degree and postgraduate qualification in town planning at London South Bank University, which led to his first planning position at East Hampshire District Council. His public sector career took him to Salisbury, Southampton, and Telford, before he joined the Borough of Poole as Head of Planning and Regeneration in 2009. Stephen is proud to have worked with Bournemouth University on the development of its estates framework. The process involved working with numerous stakeholders and marrying the university's aspirations with the borough's core planning strategy. 
It led to the construction of the Student Centre and the Fusion Building, both of which provide students with new spaces in which to learn, work and socialise. A further key element, the Pool Gateway Building, is currently under construction and will provide facilities for media production and cross-faculty collaborations. Alongside his public sector work, Stephen has enjoyed a long career with the Royal Naval Reserve. Having started out as a radio operator, he went on to command the Maritime Reserves at the rank of Commodore. The role required Stephen to oversee the management and training needs of some 3,000 personnel. Stephen reflects that the command structure of the Navy provided him with a welcome contrast to the political structures of local government. He is proud to have been able to combine these interests when he secured a permanent site for Poole's D-Day Memorial as part of the new Dolphin Keys development. Pro-Chancellor, I have the honour to present Stephen Thorne and ask you to confer upon him an honorary fellowship of Bournemouth University. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, President of the Students' Union, Mr. Abdurashid Adivinka Balogun. Greetings. I'm truly excited to be here and connected to you at this important moment of your challenging yet incredible journey. On behalf of all the students studying at Bournemouth University, I extend my warm greetings to your families, friends, and the staff. It's an honor to be addressing you this morning on behalf of the Students' Union. We all welcome you here. It's fair to say today will remain one of your memory as a graduate after hard work. Everyone has a unique story about their time here at BU, from Freshers' Fair, Summer Ball, and as well as the deadlines of coursework and assignments. As you have come to the end of one chapter, you will remember of your vanguard of all knowledge and a conscious wave of new possibility in a leadership in a world starving your knowledge and leadership. Some of us will become leaders in our own world of expertise, while others will take in a different pathway completely. Admittedly, I never saw myself having passion for student politics, but standing here as a second black international student president proves anything is possible. <clears throat> let us not dwell on the years looking back for the future because we are, let's look into the life of the unknown for something great to always remember for the future because let's look beyond our limitations and seize the opportunity that lies ahead. Let us not forget the values that we've developed through the experience of contact either from Cebu or at Bournemouth University. We are the graduates of Bournemouth University, the leaders of tomorrow. Who will change, who will change the world we wanted to see in the world? So I encourage you to approach life with an open mind, seek to learn something new every day, and be the best version of yourself. For the BU education is the gateway for future worth having. Thank you very much and God bless. This congregation is assembled for the presentation of postgraduate and undergraduate awards of the university. Pro-Chancellor, recipients of awards in the Faculty of Science and Technology will be presented by the Executive Dean, Professor Keith Falp, and received as graduates by the Vice-Chancellor, Professor John Binney.
Pro Chancellor, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, I'm pleased to present the recipients of awards for the Faculty of Science and Technology. I'm especially privileged to present the doctoral awards. These are our highest awards and represent many years of hard work and original contribution to the body of knowledge. Doctor of Philosophy, in recognition of a programme of work entitled Modelling, Analysis and Design of MAC and Routing Protocols for Wireless Body Area Sensor Networks, Mohammed Sajjad Akbar. In recognition of a program of work entitled Impact of Assistive Technologies in Supporting People with Dementia, Ikram Ashgar. In recognition of a program of work entitled performance evaluation of an ensemble neural network system of estimating transtibial prosthetic socket pressures during standing, walking, and condition perturbation, Philip Davenport. In recognition, of a program of work entitled Energy Recovery at Thermodynamic Expansion and Thermal Boosting Through Convection in Flat Plate Solar Thermal Systems, Zakir Khan. In recognition of a program of work entitled Bio-inspired robotic control in underactuation, principles of energy effic efficacy, dynamic compliance, interactions, and adaptability, Peng Cheng Le. In recognition of a program of work entitled Randomness as a CAD tool for the affective augmentation of form in product design concepts, Timothy James Reynolds. In recognition of a program of work entitled An Investigation of the Antecedents of Knowledge Management, among hospitality employees with a focus on human factors related to leaders and subordinates, Saqib Shamim. In recognition of a program of work entitled An Intelligent Destination Recommendation System for Tourists, Pri Thengburunatham. Master of Arts in Industrial Design. And with distinction, Ina Guel Lerber. <laughs> Robert Charles Mills. <laughs> Millie Song. Master of Science in Applied Data Analytics, K. 
Kang Si Ho. Joy Chinello Ifianyichuku Nuwari. Oguchuku Ann Ijevia. T. Fong Dong Pham. Vigneshwaran Selvam. And with distinction, Fiona Shorten. Uchechi Nawamaka Uwagwam. <laughs> Master of Arts in Industrial Design. And with distinction, Enna Inna Gwellerba. Okay, Master of Science in Cybersecurity and Human Factors. <laughs> Richard Chislett. <laughs> Emma Hayes. <laughs> and with distinction, Megan Plaver. Mark Richard Scott. And with distinction, Tiffany Skinner. And with distinction, Attila Sandor Vitezi. Simon James West. Postgraduate Certificate in Cybersecurity and Human Factors, and with distinction, Andrew Yates. <laughs> Master of Science in Engineering Project Management, Victor Ajahulre. <laughs> Bradley Dawson. And with distinction, Paulia, Paula Andrea Ruiz Tomeo. <laughs> Kilford Kambarai Resere. <laughs> and with distinction, Sumi Sulari. <laughs> Master of Science in Enterprise Information Systems. Vincent Michael Clark. And with distinction, Caroline Perkins. Master of Science in Information Te Technology. Coyote Damalola Adewelu. Daniel Oliyomi Asaya. <laughs> Sanjeev Goshan. <laughs> and with distinction, Sanghi Lee. <laughs> James Lovett. <laughs> and with distinction, Paramguru Prachi Ra. And with distinction, Edward Philip Richardson. Postgraduate Certificate in Computing, Tahir Gurashi Haj El Tahir Ali.
Master of Science in Internet of Things with Cybersecurity. And with distinction, Emily Belton. And with distinction, Matthew Alistair Butler. Yanis Halkas. And with distinction, Alexander Seymour. Valdemar Vogt. Master of Science in Internet of Things with Data Analytics, Nicola Sarah Lancaster. <laughs> Master of Science in Mechanical Engineering Design, Jonathan Cotton. <laughs> and with distinction, James Pawsey. And with distinction, Daniel Ward. <laughs> Master of Science in Mobile App Development, Richard Ward. <laughs> Master of Design in Product Design, Dominic Keeley. Bachelor of Arts in Product Design, Danielle Colleen Borg. <laughs> Ruby Georgia Isabella Brayford. Imogen Cummins. James Frankham. Daniel Howard. Jackson Mullins. Samuel Osinuga. Robbie Powell. Ashley Marie Shipton. Edward William Senna Vernon. Bachelor of Science in Product Design, Daniel Blickett. <laughs> Lewis Alexander Brown. <laughs> Callum Daniel Cook. <laughs> Daniel Fox. <laughs> Oliver Garner. <laughs> Jake Howard. Robert Howard. And with first class honours, Connor Lascelles. William Latham. Christopher Lee. Matthew Lingens. And with first class honours, Jordan Miles. Ayamidi Ibun Konolawa Ogunkei. Supro Tim Sakar. Harry Sop. George Thomas. Adam Wood. Chi Zhang. Master of Engineering in Engineering, Christopher Bell. And with first class honours, Luke Ferguson. And with first class honours, Daniel Allen Hoff. Gavin Andrew Kirby. And with first class honours, Nicholas Palmer. Liam Pope. And with first class honours, Jordan Ramshev. And with first class honours, Alistair Wood.
Bachelor of Engineering in Engineering, Jack Alexander. And with first class honours, Ashley Jessica Baker. And with first class honours, Ross Masketer. Lewis Paul Beltmont. Christopher William Blundell. And with first class honours, Joshua Campbell. Kit Shan Chow. Katie Collier. Gregory Coop. Nathan Crane. Samuel Curtis. And with first class honours, Joshua Dawson. Gleason Rogerio de Oliveira. Charlie John Roy Evans. Daniel Gilbert. Georgina Griffin. And with first class honours, Joseph Hindley. Annie Hussain. Mohammed Tamim Ibrahim. Edward Inge. And with first class honours, Nicholas Andrew James. Leonildo Gomez Alfonso Lima. And with first class honours, Billy Jordan Love. James Mannering. And with first class honours, Petio Bojidorov Maitev. Jareth Reeves. Ben Richards. And with first class honours, Alexander Seaton Smith. Max Skull. Matthew Daniel Walker. And with first class honours, Matthew William Pedram Wilde. Bachelor of Arts in Industrial Design, Michael Richard Belk, Jasper Zavar Crow, Daniel Dinnick, Cassandra Dyer, Julius Henrik Merilainen. And with first class honours, Stephanie Maria Pereira. Jack Richardson. Cedric Percy Sam. Joseph Tencher. Rhys Tumbridge. And with first class honours, Rini Van Chong. Bachelor of Arts in Product Design, May Bowley. <laughs> Frederick Gibbs. <laughs> Stephen Pickett. <laughs> Zachary Price. <laughs> Thomas Riley. <laughs> and with first class honours, Emily Stock. Cameron Walton. <laughs> Certificate of Higher Education Product Design, George Harry Lawford. <laughs> Bachelor of Engineering in Telecommunication Systems Engineering. And with first class honours, Michael Anthony Appleton.
and with first class honours, Brian William Clark. And with first class honours, Isaac Keith Fong. And with first class honours, Matthew James Holmes. And with first class honours, Neil David Shelley. And with first class honours, Christopher Anthony Slade. And with first class honours, Sebastian Van Pell. And with first class honours, Frederick Anthony Winter. Bachelor of Science in 3D Computer Generated Imagery, Architectural Visualization, Jamie Blinko. And with first class honors, Christian Truss. Bachelor of Science in 3D Computer Generated Imagery, Modeling and Animation, Kieran Hallisey. And with first class honours, Ryan Hancock. And with first class honours, James Wing Hang Lee. George Raybold. And with first class honours, Jessica Tarrant. Bachelor of Science in Business Information Technology. Nazim Ahmed. And with first class honours, Jessica Booth. Jessica Elizabeth Cookson. And with first class honours, Jamie Alexander Cotter. And with first class honours, Eduardo Philippe Afonso de Mar. Daniel Charles Dawson. Patrick Duda. And with first class honours, George David Edney. And with first class honours, Jack Emerson Pine. Philip Robert Ewington. Adam Lawton. And with first class honours, Taylor Mitchell. Veselin Peshev. Damien Payakut. Arnos Poon. Samuel David Ratcliffe. Daniel George Robertson. And with first class honours, Joshua Tubana. And with first class honours, Gareth Beale. Sarah Ann Whitfield. Annabelle Lee Wood. Dale Stephen Wingard. Certificate of Higher Education in Computing, Rafael Stolnicki. <laughs> Bachelor of Science in Computer Networks, Vitali Andrusiak. <laughs> Jack Curtis. <laughs> John Ashton Davies. And with first class honours, Benjamin Lister. Toby McDade. Lewis Ace Strecker. Andrew Taylor. And with first class honours, Alex Templeman. Bachelor of Science in Computing. And with first class honours, Callum Barham. 
Dean Barnett. Raymond Boardman. And with first class honours, Jacob Allen Breen. James Buckley. Kieran Byrne. Benjamin Kane. Tom Eddie Cobb. James Coe. Benjamin Coleman. Joseph Cox. Barry Cumming. And with first class honours, Oliver Benjamin Curtis. <laughs> Bailey Farrant. <laughs> Simon Holvey. And with first class honours, Georgia Marie Shilson Isaac. <laughs> Maya Kilpatrick Wood. And with first class honours, William Knight. And with first class honours, Stephen Knowles. Chayanit Krayit. Perry Lau. Lauren Morgan. And with first class honours, Alexander Frank Paget. And with first class honours, William Parcel Jones. And with first class honours, Timothy John Puckeridge. Luke Michael Peter Rainbow. Thomas Sims. Andrew George Vasili. Connor Elliot Walton. And with first class honours, Tyrone Williams. And with first class honours, Edward Christopher Williamson. Damien Wilmer. Robert David Witcher. Diploma of Higher Education in Computing, Jonathan Marshall. Bachelor of Science in Cybersecurity Management, Sarjida Afreen. <laughs> Renart Maxwell. <laughs> Bachelor of Science in Design Engineering, Matthew Barker. <laughs> Fergus John Wilson Brady. Josh Chatralia. Joseph John Fox. James Paul Harker. And with first class honours, James Leonard House. Maximilian Kennedy. And with first class honours, Sinead Karina Lemon. And with first class honours, Robert Paul Alastair Lewis. Ryan Masterson. And with first class honours, Jonathan Naish. Oliver James Staniland. Maxwell Jonathan Taylor. And with first class honours, Katie Toogood. And with first class honours, Joshua David Vowles. <laughs> Bachelor of Science in Forensic Computing and Security, Kofi A.J. Chum. <laughs> Alexander James Britton. Sean Broham. And with first class honours, Bethany Bunker. And with first class honours, Zoe Louise Carter. 
Holly Clark. Marcus Elliott Coleman. Joshua Coles. Matthew Corner. Adam Ayres. And with first class honours, Omolola Fagbuli. And with first class honours, Beth Fairbanks. Joshua John Farmer. Jacob Fricker. And with first class honours, Adele Hanks. William Hannington. Martin William Hargrave. Nathan Harrison. And with first class honours, Daniel Robert Hoffman. Grant Hogan. Stephen Anthony Hopkins. Jeremy Hughes. And with first class honours, Mark Hunt. Shoei Doll Islam. Lewis James. And with first class honours, Karuninya Jagathipan. And with first class honours, Victoria Kelly. Matthew James Laverton. Matthew Loughton. Benjamin McGarry. Harry McGibbon. Rachel Efulowa Moritawan. Lewis Morris. Thomas Murray. Philip Kyle O'Hagan. Samuel Ollington. Mitchell James Leonard Phillips. Charlotte Emma Rawlinson. Hamza Serfraz. Rihanna Stanislaus Osborne. And with first class honours, Jamie Tizard. Jack Wills. Michael Wren. Bethany Yoren. <laughs> Bachelor of Science in Games Programming. And with first class honours, Algidas Baltunas. <laughs> Joshua Briggs. <laughs> Thomas Coldwell. And with first class honours, Samuel Cooksley. Nathan Kultas. Jack Dallas. Liam Michael Davis. And with first class honours, Adam, Adam Patrick Fairs. George Gall. Daniel Louis Green. Kyle Hadley. And with first class honours, James Hardy. Zach Harris. Kylan Francis Mason Hendrickson. Aidan Ireland. Aaron Nicholas Kelsey. And with first class honours, Victor Mark Leach. 
Connor Kane Martin, Corey Frederick Middleton, Thomas Millen, Owen Parry, and with first class honours, Graham Wrigler. Nathan Roberts, and with first class honours, Sebastian Russell, Marcus Schrock, Christian Stane, and with first class honours, Ryan James Thorne, and with first class honours, Robert Tuvey. Nader Vedotas, and with first class honours, Cody Way, and with first class honours, Kane White. Diploma of Higher Education in Games Technology, Alexander Stevenson. Bachelor of Science in Games Technology, Thomas Henry James Barrett. Archie Robert Bendel. And with first class honours, Guy Boxall. Kareem Buckley. William Calstray. Samantha Clark, Robert Cook, Callum James Cullerton, Andrew Darby, Elliot Doyle, Edgar Alexander Guillete. And with first class honours, Jake Giles Phillips. And with first class honours, Joseph Michael Grocott. Philip Groves. And with first class honours, Joshua Stephen Hatch. And with first class honours, Lewis Joe Hill. And with first class honours, David Hurst. Daniel Samir Mosse. Jake Oliver Rugier. Matthew George Sanders. And with first class honours, Jacob Anton Shadbolt. Farbod Shakuri. Samuel Simmons. Ryan Thomas. Connor Wakefield. Joshua Weatherall. Samuel Williamson. Alexander Wood. Callum Young. Bachelor of Science in Information Technology Management, and with first class honours, Isabel Barley. And with first class honours, Thomas Rubin Butler. Joshua Chilcott. And with first class honours, Daniel Corder. Dillian Gel Dylan Gelani. Josh, Jonathan Gordon, Charlotte Annabelle Louise Higgins, Abigail Lake, Joseph O'Dell, Kane O'Keefe, Eleanor Papworth. 
and with first class honours, Janika Rangari. Tyler Ross. And with first class honours, George Scott. Nicole May Watters. Bachelor of Science in Management Information Systems, Luke Christian Carey. <laughs> BJ Ray Bantua. <laughs> Bachelor of Science in Music and Audio Technology, James Backham. James David Bantock. <laughs> Hugh Bocott. <laughs> Joseph Cook. <laughs> Dominic Deanst. <laughs> Jake Gregory. <laughs> Hannah Geraldine Holgate. <laughs> Ryan Martin. Kevin Rye. <laughs> Bachelor of Science in Music and Sound Production Technology, Troy Stevie Bowerbank. <laughs> Matthew Kane. <laughs> Ross Chapman. <laughs> Christopher Christophoru. James Clark. Radu Alexandru Dimitriou. Gareth Luke Dyer. Megan Fairbrother. And with first class honours, Joshua Gwilt. Liam Harrison. Javed Hoji. Andrew Johnson. Benjamin Kidd. Jun Hyuk Kim. Jack Francis Daniel Landy. Samuel Lands. Arthur Maple. <laughs> Alicia Faye Pollocksven. <laughs> Ryan James Sanderson Parr. <laughs> Jake Saunders. <laughs> Samuel Eric Edward Scarrett. <laughs> Abraham Shrifian. Jake Thomas Smith. Harley West. James Anderson Whittle. Leon Winter. Diploma of Higher Education in Music Technology, Gregory Ogunyowe. Bachelor of Science in Product Design, Dominic Allen. <laughs> Joseph Elliott Broadhead. <laughs> Eddie Diong Ekpong and Sek. <laughs> Vimal Kumar Prajapati. <laughs> Freddie James Craven Snellgar. Richard Stone. <laughs> Timothy Taylor. <laughs> Kui T. <laughs> and with first class honours, Max Daniel Tomlinson. 
Diploma of Higher Education in Product Design, Adi Fisola Karunwi. <laughs> Bachelor of Science in Software Engineering, Svetoslav Anastasov. Matthew Bayes. Abdirizak Bedel. Jordan Blackman. John Cranston. And with first class honours, Daniel Dimonol. And with first class honours, Ryan Duncan. And with first class honours, Derek Ayiti Fahey. Oliver Robert Holloway. Joel Holmes. Marcus Lewis. Samuel Alexander Lush. And with first class honours, Howell Martin. Michael Babatunde Musa. And with first class honours, Andrew Myers. And with first class honours, Max Nealon. Jenna Pago. And with first class honours, Benjamin Pitfield. Sebastian Julian Polina. Ludmil Popov. Ashley Prince. Andrew David Ramsier. Jonathan Reeves. Reuben Lewis Slipman. And with first class honours, Christopher Waghorn. And with first class honours, Joe Buster Waite. And with first class honours, Stephen James Worley. And with first class honours, Burak Ere Yuxel. Foundation degree in Engineering in Engineering, Manufacturing Management. And with distinction, Thomas Alexander Walker. And with distinction, Harry William Wilkinson. <laughs> Foundation degree in Engineering and Engineering Mechanical Design. And with distinction, William Whitworth. <laughs> Foundation degree in Science in 3D CGI, Modeling and Animation, Lewis Barker. Rhiannon Eason. Abraham Sehelu. Foundation degree in science in communication systems engineering. And with distinction, Rajendra Dangi. And with distinction, Richard Luke Thompson. And with distinction, Stephen David Williams. <laughs> Certificate of Higher Education in Communication Systems Engineering, Baikash Gurung. <laughs> Foundation degree in Science in Computing, and with distinction, Rafti Cawthorn. And with distinction, Aaron Leal. And with distinction, Victor Elvov. Dean Leslie J. McLeod. Higher National Certificate in Engineering, Electronic Design, James Clark.
Hannah Jadzia Lauder. <laughs> Higher National Certificate in Engineering, Manufacturing Management, and with distinction, Stephen James Downer. <laughs> Dale Michael Francis. <laughs> Matthew Andrew Hobbs. Bachelor of Science, Games Programming, Bradley James Pierce. <laughs> Bachelor of Science, Forensic Computing and Security, Luke Holmes. <laughs> Bachelor of Science, Business Information Technology, Arta Apaikov. Tayefer Rahman. <laughs> Bachelor of Science in Design Engineering, Sebastian Alexander Horodeki. <laughs> Master of Science in Applied Data Analytics, Vigneshwaran Selvan. Chancellor. That concludes the presentation awards for the Faculty of Science and Technology. Pro Chancellor, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, I'm pleased to present. Sorry. I'm pleased to present the recipients of awards for the Faculty of Science and Technology. Uh, okay, sorry. <laughs> We have prizes for the Faculty of Science and Technology. The Vice-Chancellor will present the first three prizes, and the first two prizes are awarded to the same student. So the Vice-Chancellor's prize is awarded to the undergraduate student whose performance or achievement is deemed by the Vice-Chancellor to have been most outstanding in their time at BU. And the Dean's prize is awarded to the best final year student in the Faculty of Science and Technology. And they're both awarded to Georgia Isaac. <laughs> the postgraduate taught prize to the postgraduate student whose performance or achievement is deemed by the Vice-Chancellor to have been most outstanding in their time at BU. And is awarded to Matthew Butler. Thank you, Vice-Chancellor.
Next, we have prizes presented by the Faculty of Science and Technology sponsors and colleagues. The best final year undergraduate student prize awarded to the undergraduate student who has achieved the highest academic standards from all undergraduate programs represented in the morning ceremony. Presented by Professor Chan Chan Zhang and awarded to Sinead Lemon. Best Final Year Postgraduate Student Prize, awarded to the postgraduate student who has achieved the highest academic standards from all postgraduate programs represented in this morning's ceremony. Presented by Professor Chan Jiang Zhang and awarded to Daniel Ward. BizTech Award for Best Final Year Project in Business Technology, awarded for the Best Final Year Project, presented by Emily Harmer, and awarded to Daniel Hoffman. The Institute of Engineering Designers Prize is awarded for best final year projects on the design engineering programme. And we have a range of these awarded to a number of students. They're presented by Simon Benfield, and the first is to Rini Van Chong. Dominic Keeley. <laughs> William Whitworth. Daniel Hoff. <laughs> Sinead Lemon. <laughs> J.P. Morgan Prize for Excellence in Technology, awarded for Excellence in Technology in Computing and Informatics, presented by Dr. Simon Broadbridge, Executive Director of J.P. Morgan, awarded to Benjamin Lister. ASM Assembly Systems Weymouth Prize, awarded to the best final year student demonstrating innovation and enterprise in their course, assessed through project work for the current academic year. Presented by Dr. Chris Shaw and awarded to Fergus Brady. Chancellor. That concludes the presentation of prizes for the Faculty of Science and Technology.
Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, please join us in giving all recipients of awards and prizes a final round of applause. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, the Vice-Chancellor, Professor John Binney. I absolutely love graduation. This week, I get to meet all of our graduating students. 3,962 to be exact, and have the very great honor of being the first person to congratulate you as you cross the stage. Now I can see the look of relief on many of your faces as you walk towards me. Uh, it's a very long walk, so well done on making it across in one piece. <laughs> now graduates, you're now BU alumni, and I know how great that is because I'm one too. So I once crossed this very same stage and sat where you are today. So I know what a milestone today is for you, but also how important and significant it is for all of your family and friends. Truly a day of celebration. Meeting up with your friends from the course, remembering your time at BU, and taking films and photos to capture the moment, creating memories that you and your family will cherish forever. The motto of this university on the university crest is discere mutari est, which means to learn is to change. And since I was here as a student, BU has been on an amazing journey and changed beyond all recognition. Our vision for BU is based on the fusion of education, research and professional practice. And we believe that by bringing these elements together, we can fulfill our purpose to inspire learning advanced knowledge and enriched society. And it's your achievements recognized here today are the launch pad for your amazing journeys and the sky is the limit. I say the sky is the limit, but actually there are no limits. So why stop at the sky? It will be a journey full of opportunities and challenges, a journey that will require you to continually learn, change and adapt in order to succeed in this increasingly fast paced, competitive and globally connected world. It will not be easy, but you've already demonstrated that you're up for a challenge. The challenge now is how to take what you've learnt and make a difference. Education is about changing lives, our own lives and the lives of those around us. So it does help us to leave a world a better place than we found it. And the world is certainly in need of your help. Now, my decision to study at this institution changed my life forever and my journey has led me to this stage today. And to lead such a fantastic university is a great honor and a privilege. I'm proud of what we're achieving at BU, inspiring learning through students, graduates, our staff and the wider community, advancing knowledge through our research and education, and enriching society through the impact of our work and the impact of our students and staff having on the world. I'm proud of my colleagues who have supported you through your time at BU, and you will have noticed some familiar faces both on the stage or in the hall today, your lecturers and professional support staff. And like me, they were incredibly proud to watch you walk across the stage. And I'd like to take this opportunity to thank each and every one of them for their contribution, and in particular for making BU such an inclusive, happy, dynamic and thriving academic learning community. So please do give them a wave if you can catch their eye and join me in thanking them with a huge round of applause. Another reason I love graduation is because I have the great pleasure of meeting all of your family and friends and of addressing those who aren't able to be here but are watching us live from around the world. Now succeeding at university requires a huge amount of hard work, tenacity and determination and you should all be extremely proud of what you've achieved. But none of you did this alone. 
Without those helping you to support you, your parents, carers, partners, families and friends, none of this would have been possible. People who supported you when you made those difficult decisions about what and where to study. People who manned the helplines 24-7 back home. People who were there for you when the pressure started to build and those all-important final results were awaited. And I have three daughters, so I know firsthand what a roller coaster of emotions this journey can be. So I'm delighted to see so many of your supporters here to share this moment with you. And graduates, I now invite you to stand up, turn around, and join me in showing your thanks with a huge round of applause. nice. So life at university is about so much more than studying. Other activities you take part in are also opportunities to learn and to develop. And this year we achieved our highest ever points and ranking in the British Universities and Colleges Sports League table, finishing in 22nd place out of more than 170 universities across the country. So thank you and congratulations to all of you who have been part of Team BU. Thank you. Now, many of you have also been involved in our fantastic Students' Union, SUBU, and we heard from the President a bit earlier. The wide range of clubs, societies, and community groups that you've been part of, and your experience in organising and participating in those, will, I'm sure, help you in whatever you do next. And many of you graduating today have also contributed enormously to BU and the wider community through volunteering, fundraising, and charity work. So, on behalf of the local community and those further afield, that you've helped and supported, I would again like to say a big thank you. Now, the Faculty of Science and Technology has once again this year gone from strength to strength. We continue to work with our industry partners and businesses to focus on professional accreditation and industry experience to equip our graduates for your next steps. And this year, I was delighted that a company founded by a BU graduate received a Queen's Award for Enterprise, a major achievement, so well done. Now, I know my colleagues have really enjoyed working with you and they now have a few messages that they would like to share. Congratulations! Congratulations! Thank you for letting us be a part of your journey so far. You've, You've already, already achieved, achieved so much. much. And we can't wait to see what you do next. And, and remember, remember to, to keep, keep in touch. Congratulations! Congratulations! It's been great having you here the last few years. Congratulations! It's been an honour to help you get started. Congratulations! Congratulations, everyone! We've, We've loved, loved having, having you, you with, with us. us. Now, get out there and be great. Congratulations! <laughs> I would like to add my personal best wishes for the future. You are now all automatically members of the BU Alumni Association, so please do make sure that you sign up and then make the most of our ongoing services and support. We want to hear about your amazing journeys. I really hope you've enjoyed this ceremony, and I'd like to thank all of those who have been part of making it such a success, our dignitaries and distinguished guests, uh, members of the University Board for their continued support and commitment, and a particular thank you to Val Pitt-Rivers, who has presided today as our Pro-Chancellor. And this is indeed Val's last ceremony as Pro-Chancellor. Um, you have been a fantastic ambassador, Val, for BU, and an enthusiastic supporter over the last five years. And I want to thank you personally for your friendship, but also for your support and service as Pro-Chancellor for BU. So thank you.
So please do now join me and my colleagues after the ceremony in the Purbeck Hall for the after party to continue the celebrations. Thank you. Congregation, please stand for the national anthem and the retiring procession. <laughs> 